Hey everyone and thanks for tuning in for this Paranormal Pit Stop. As we've mentioned in our last few uploads, we're currently working through the startup of a new on-site series called Sleepovers, which will have yours truly and a friend exploring some of the most haunted locales around in person for a one-of-a-kind experience. Before its launch, share us with anyone and everyone you know so we can give it the welcome it deserves. And now for tonight's haunt, nestled off the corner of Newcomb Avenue and 3rd Street in the Bayview Hunters Point District of San Francisco, California, is a venue widely accepted as the oldest existing theater in the whole of its sprawling city. Also referred to as the Ruth Williams Memorial Theater and rumored to entertain a host of paranormal energies tied to its past, are you prepared to brave the history and spirits at the Bayview Opera House? Historically, in 1888, this prestigious old building was designed by prominent San Diego architect Henry Gielfel, whose work through the era is recognized amongst some of the most notable of constructs. Impressively, the Bayview would survive the 1906 San Francisco earthquake, and for years it would serve not just as a theater but also as a community hub at which cultural events, rallies, fairs, and gatherings were held. On September 28th of 1966, the theater, or more specifically the Bayview Community Center housed within, would act as scene to what was later labeled the Hunter Point Social Uprising, which was a significant armed standoff between an angered populace and police forces. During during which shots were fired, injuries were incurred, but fortunately no lives were lost. In 1968, this weathered theater would be declared a city landmark, and later, in 2011, it would be honored as a listing on the National Register of Historic Places. From 2014 to 2016, the site would undergo a slew of renovations and refurbs, aimed at bringing the property up to code while simultaneously restoring its original ambiance and charm. The Bayview Opera House remains open into the present, hosting an assortment of performances, community events, and more, while offering ample educational opportunities, fundraisers, tours, and the like. Rather classically, this aged venue is surrounded by a mess of local legends and ghost stories, with the general consensus being that haunted activity on site is a result of lingering souls of the many who worked in, cared for, or attended the theater in lives since past, and those who frequent its space have reported extreme cold spots felt in the heat of summer, disembodied voices heard from empty rooms, and instances of doors that open briefly and then close shortly after as if being passed through by someone unseen. Several informal investigations of the theater have yielded high EMF levels, crystal clear EVPs, and orbs in strange forms in photography and video, while staff have mentioned prop and set pieces moving on their own or disembodied footsteps heard from seating rows that are completely vacant. Electrical anomalies are all but common across the property, with constant reports of abnormal battery death rates in electronics, of appliances that seemingly act on their own accord, and of lights that flicker or turn off spontaneously, leaving all present in darkness. Actors stuck in the dressing room alone have reported an inexplicable sense of foreboding, and confined to no area in particular, many have described feeling as if they are being watched or followed by someone or something not perceptible to the human eye, and in some cases, have even reported feeling an invisible finger or hand touch or tap them. Lastly, countless full-bodied apparitions have been sighted wandering the theater, and during several rehearsals, entire casts have finished their lines only to be met with the startling sound of jovial applause from a freshly manifested spectral audience that yells for an encore before vanishing just as quickly as they first appeared. Thanks for joining us on this Paranormal Pit Stop. If you enjoyed our histories and ghost stories, subscribe to our channel, like this upload, and share us with anyone and everyone you know so Sleepovers gets the welcome it deserves upon launch. As always, pleasant dreams.